Hey everybody, it is time now to imagine it. We are on location at the Imagination Station where Carl Nelson's the chief scientist. He's also the chief flower child. Good morning to you. <laughs> Good Carl. morning. We are gonna do some really cool science for Mother's Day. Okay. okay? It's, it's coming up and with some really simple ingredients at home, you can take a white carnation and turn it into one of these beauties. Very here. nice. Multicolored carnation. As long as it's not messy, mom's gonna love it. There is a little potential right. for mess. There's potential. <laughs> There's always potential for mess. Now, plants move water through their uh, systems through a couple processes. One is uh, capillary action, drawing water up the stems, and then evaporation where the water leaves through the petals. Okay? So let's look at capillary action really close. I got a really cool okay. demo here for this. Um, I got two plates of glass, okay? And I've got a popsicle stick in one side and they're wedged together. So basically this is a wide gap and it narrows down to a thin gap on so that side. A simulated microscope plate. Yeah, in fact, you could do this with microscope slides in a classroom. So if you're a teacher, check this out. Tony, I got some food coloring in there. Go ahead and carefully just pour that whole thing or down here near the end. Down near the bottom. Okay. This, is, this is where it can get messy. We're gonna try to minimize the mess a little bit. All right. We're just doing a big scale here so you can see. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick this piece of glass inside there. We're just gonna hold it there for a second. So we have basically a wedge, really tiny gap on this side, big gap on that side. And what's gonna happen is those water molecules are gonna like to stick to the glass. They're gonna be drawn upward and upward where the cap gap is really tiny. Okay, so you can imagine in plants, the plants can be like a, a bundle of soda straws with lots of little tubes in them that the water can move up through. And in just a few seconds here, I'm gonna pull it out of the liquid there. I don't know if you can see that, wow, how, the, that, how it's actually being drawn up at least two or three inches on this side. If we leave it in there long enough, we can nearly get to the top. Nice. Okay, so that's an example of capillary action. Sure. And that is what we will use to make our flowers into these uh, beautiful colors. Now, if you... I remember from science class that water molecules are actually sticky and you would think otherwise. They are. Cohesion next to themselves and adhesion to other things. Now, if you just want a red flower, all you have to do is stick it in a a beaker or a test tube filled with some red food coloring. Sure. If you don't have a beaker or a test tube at home, you can use a soda straw, yeah. right? So you can, and that way you can economize on the mess, right? Okay. <laughs> so you just have, you shove that down in there with a little bit of food coloring and your whole thing will be colored, okay? Now if you want to get really fancy, which is what I know what you want to do, to get a two-colored flower, you simply split the ends. Okay, so one side goes in green, one side goes in red, and you have a multicolored wow. carnation. Oh, what and, a good idea. And you can do the same thing with a soda straw. Just put two of them next to one another and shove the stems down inside. Now, how long there. does it take to let it sit? Surprisingly, it's relatively quick. And it depends on the humidity in your home. If your humidity is low, you'll start to see this in, in a matter of an hour or two. And in fact, I did a little time-lapse video over okay. here that shows what happens as that food coloring is drawn in. This is about a two-hour process, and you can really see how that color gets super saturated inside there as wow. and even really the evaporation fun. effects of the petals starting to move and those are not just special effects those no, are no, no, natural this, is, this is actual stuff and it's so simple you can do it at home food coloring soda straw some carnations you are quite the cinematographer well if you want to see Carl in action he might have a flower for you and your mom here <laughs> at the imagination station the times are on your screen and of course they open in just a few minutes here at 10 o'clock in the morning thanks again Carl sure you can put one of those on your I'll, lapel I'll, I'll, I'll oh, leave thanks that for very you. much all right <laughs> that is how you imagine it <laughs>